What's up, graphic designers? It's Tuesday, September 24th, 2019, and as interested as I am in the trump ukraine controversy, instead, I clicked on this article right here, The Wests Go Western, inside Kim and Kanye's New Life and Coding, Cody Wyoming, not because I care about them as people or as artists or as individuals or about the uh, heartland. The reason I clicked on this is because of this visual right here. We're going to take some inspiration from this. So we're going to be superimposing heads on either famous paintings or historical photos. So what we're going to do is we're going to open up Photoshop. We're going to open up the blank. I'm going to return to uh, this Google image search and there's a lot of images that we can choose from. We're going to do a uh, something school appropriate. We got this image from the Great Depression. I'm going to right click, select copy image. I'm going to press Command V, Command T, and you know this is certainly a beautiful and compelling image. I'm pressing and holding shift to keep it of course proportional and uh, there we go. So what we're going to do now is we're going to superimpose a famous person onto this image and um, I, the first person I could think of was Ariana Grande. I know she's a fan of some students in class. We're going to right click. We're going to select copy image but we're not going to paste it in into this layer right here. Instead what we're going to do is we're going to click on file new I'm going to press enter, command V, I'm going to press command plus, and I'm going to use the magnetic lasso. We just learned that tool yesterday, and this is not a high res image. You guys are going to get ideally higher res images, and I'm going to go around and I'm going to get just her face, and we'll see what happens. I honestly don't know how this is going to turn out. We've got a selection, I'm going to press command C, I'm going to return to this image right here, command V, command T, and um, all right, the depression just got a little bit more glamorous. All right, so that looks kind of cool right there. Uh, and now I'm going to do a few things. The very first thing I'm going to do is because we want to see her fingers pop through, right? Just to make it seem as if they're actually on the face. So I'm going to press V for the move tool. I'm going to press 5 for 50%. I'm going to press E for the eraser. I'm going to right click and I notice that the hardness is at 82. I'm going to bounce it up to 90 and I like this at 67%. And so now I'm just going to go like this, and I'm just sort of cutting away at this image. I'm just erasing it. I'm going to press V0. Now it's back at 100%. I'm going to zoom out a tad. Oh, okay. And now what we're going to do is a few different ways we can go about doing this. We can desaturate the image by pressing Command-Shift-U, and then Command-L to do levels, and I'm going to adjust the levels. Um, by lighting, lighting the lights a little bit, darkening the darts, so it matches. Um, lastly, I'm going to press the letter E for eraser. I'm going to drop the hardness down from 90 now to like 35 to soften it up. I'm going to increase the edge, and I'm just going to go like this, and I'm softening up this right here, and whatever. All right, sure. So we've got one instance of a famous person in a historical photo. You guys can do paintings. You can honestly do current images. I'm just curious about um, how you can wield the magnetic lasso in a new and exciting way. Good luck.